viewers, thanks for returning. I hope this video finds you happy and doing well. As you know by the thumbnail, this video is going to be on a new moisturizing cream. So if you're interested, then just keep watching. So as you know by the thumbnail, this video is going to be on Saturday Skin New Carrot and Niacinamide Moisturizing Cream. But before I get into that, I want to get a little housekeeping out of the way. If you aren't following me on IG, definitely go over there and check me out. I do additional content over there there where I do little mini clips, I do post stories, just a lot of stuff that you won't see on YouTube. So I got that out of the way. Let's get into this. So I did receive this complimentary to review for you all and Saturday Skin does provide a code for you all. I'll list it down below. I don't get any type of kickbacks or anything. This is just for you all's benefit if you decide to get the cream. Comes in a glass jar like this. It does feel substantial, very nice. And here is the outside packaging. Now I have to say that I really do love the fact that Saturday Skin is a vegan company. It is considered clean which means it's not going to have any parabens, uh, formaldehydes, uh, sulfates, and things like that. Um, and I really haven't seen any fragrance. So you're not going to get any of that in your skincare. And I just need to say my favorite out of the three that I already have is this Saturday Skin 10% Glycolic Plus Pore Control Complex. I think it does a really good job of gently just sloughing away those dead skin cells and minimizing the appearance of your pores. This is really nice. Now, I do have to say that if you do have sensitive skin, uh, be careful with it because you might feel a little tingling. Even I feel it and I'm totally used to the acids that are out there. So I just wanted to make you all aware of that. So getting back to this one, I've had the opportunity to use it one time and I did enjoy it. It felt really nice. Of course, I can't speak to the efficacy of it or the longevity of it or if it will help with your skin, but I can tell you that it really does feel good on the skin and it's more of a thicker type of consistency. It is white and this is it right here. It's really nice. I'm trying to think of another moisturizer that I could compare it to. If I can think of one, I'll put it on the screen. So when I first got it, the first thing that I immediately looked for, you all know the ingredients. And what I was really excited about, and I don't think that I've really seen it in a cream is, um, some of the main ingredients were within the first five on the ingredients list. So it had squalene and you all know that squalene is going to help soften the skin texture, moisturize the skin, as well as reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. So that was nice to see and that came in as the second ingredient. And then I think it was the fourth ingredient, uh, which was niacinamide. And at this point, <laughs> um, I know you all know niacinamide, like the back of your hand. It is a really good ingredient, especially if you are trying to purchase skincare products that are anti-aging and that are just going to maintain the health of your skin. And niacinamide just helps to improve the skin's moisture barrier while addressing any issues that you have with your pores. And it also helps with hyperpigmentation. It addresses oxidative stress as well as regulate any oil production. So you all know that niacinamide is probably uh, one of the star ingredients out there that you should look for um, in any skincare product that you have. And I also noticed that it has tranexamic acid in it, which is a plus. And that ingredient came down somewhere in the middle. So I just wanted to mention those to you and just to remind you when you're out there looking for your skincare products definitely take a look at the ingredients um, look to see if they have alcohol or fragrance or parabens or anything like that now I do have to say um, even though a product may have those ingredients that's not to say that it's a bad product but those are some that you do want to look for and as far as the alcohols just remember that you have 
fatty alcohols, which are the friendly, those are the good ones, and you have the, uh, the other alcohols, the non-fatty ones, and those are the ones that we just want to be careful about because they can irritate the skin as well as dry the skin out, and that's something that we don't want. So for this particular moisturizer, it does have like a special or a signature um, ingredient by Saturday Skin, and it's their signature seven peptide blend, and it's just a mix of seven different peptides, which is good. This particular moisturizer just has a lot of goodies in it and I could really tell when I applied it. Now again, I only used it once, but you can tell when you use a moisturizer how it feels, um, how it feels on your skin after you've had it on for an hour, two hours, three hours. You know, those are the things that I like to look for on, you know, the first impressions. You know, how is this making my skin feel? So now that we've talked about those ingredients, let's talk a little bit about the carrot. In this particular moisturizer, there are three forms of carrot. They have the beta carotene, uh, the carrot root oil, as well as the carrot water. And you all know that carrots are rich in antioxidants. And it helps with so many things. It helps with cell turnover. It it also works as an anti-inflammatory and an antibacterial agent. So again, this moisturizer has pretty much um, a powerhouse hodgepodge of ingredients, in my opinion. I am going to come up close so you can get a really good look at the jar, um, the actual moisturizer, and I am going to demo it just so you can see how it looks on my skin. And as far as a recommendation on how to apply it, they say to apply it going into an upward motion on your face, going into a circular motion to rub it in, and then just kind of pat it. And that is the recommended application. I think that that works, but I found it better just to kind of apply it and you know, of course, go in an upward motion and rub it in gently in a circular motion. So that is pretty much it. I just wanted to drop in here really fast, tell you all about a new product out. Um, also, they will exclusively be at Nordstrom's and Saturday Skin, and it's releasing today. If you're interested in getting a new moisturizer, uh, something that has like a powerhouse of anti-aging ingredients, I would definitely say to check this out.